Do you have an analogy or some sort of kind of thing that you've built around a recent concept or difficult thing that you're trying to get across to someone? Yeah, pro probably, yeah. Let's have a little think. So sort of rack in the brains. Um, I like to stick with things that I know pretty well and mm. that I feel would be universal. So I was talking recently about trying to explain how humans could work together effectively. And I, I was thinking about the idea of a jazz band. And in a jazz band, if someone is doing something really, really wrong, really atonal. Either it's like modern jazz that four people <laughs> in the world like, okay. or it genuinely is something that no, you know, it's yeah. not going to work. So, but if everyone's kind of playing the same thing, it's ordinary stuff, then it won't be exciting to the listeners. People don't come to jazz to hear kind of fairly ordinary stuff mm -hmm. playing. So they want a balance between everyone doing their own thing, but it also working in harmony together. Yeah. And m music is one of those beautiful things where you can be you could be really offensively, wretchedly wrong mm -hmm. with music. You start giving a kid a violin, I don't care if they're sort of some Japanese master or something. If you give a violin to a kid who's four year old, it's gonna, it's gonna sound terrible. Maybe for a few months, maybe for some people for 10 years. So music has that ability to really, really be dissonant, really cause a significant pain. Yeah. I don't know what that is. It's like one of the funniest things ever. It's almost impossible to switch off from a really, really bad sound, right? You can't just turn away and not look at it. It just envelops <laughs> you. So music is one of those awful things, yeah. but done well with alignment. So I think that's kind of a nice way of saying, well, maybe on a political level, how humans could get along. If we were all doing our own thing, but within this kind of alignment, so the end product was better than for the, everybody yeah. than the sub. You know, listening to a great solo on its own, without the harmonic background, without all the chord changes, Great, so even Charlie Parker stuff, you take his, just play it on his own with nothing else, no, no background, nothing else to sort of make magical. It sounds, well, not rubbish, but it doesn't sound special at all. As a, as, yeah. So, yeah, that was a recent analogy that I'm sort of working with and trying to stay in. And, and I like, um, what I like doing with analogies is trying to stay in the metaphor as much as you can and really make it work. So try and pull everything into like Different. the jazz band analogy. Yeah.